medical team saved his life three times. And today, a local man got to say thank you to that team and was all part of National Hospital Week. And the man then sat down with medical reporter Liz Bonus at UC Medical Center to explain how this all happened. And it's a story you'll only see on Local 12 News. He was having dinner in one of his favorite restaurants when suddenly... I just slumped over the table, had no warning, no symptom that I was having a heart attack. Talk about living right. Two physicians, part of the team here, just happened to be there to perform CPR. I think one was picking up a carryout order. Two great physicians kept me alive for the ambulance to transport me to this wonderful hospital. But even in transport, there were challenges. So I think I had two more arrests, and uh, but they were wonderful. And then, once many of the members you see here were able to get him stable enough... His uh, recovery after the, um, the code in the restaurant was complicated by pneumonia, which is pretty, pretty common. Patients aspirate often in the setting of a cardiac arrest. Uh, he underwent a hypothermia cooling protocol that we typically do after arrest and um, really needed ultimately to get to surgery to, to fix the, the coronary vascular disease that he had. I wasn't stable enough for the operating room. This hospital week, he got to express his gratitude, and so did his family members. All the teams of people were so caring and kind. As you might imagine, it was quite emotional. And you do some really amazing work. To see him come back is a privilege we don't often get. It, it, it really does remind you of why you do this every single day. So today, not only a special thank you, but a reminder to all of us that there are certain things that we too can know that might also help save a life. If you hadn't had knowledgeable people, skilled people doing that in the restaurant, he never would have survived um, to, to get to the hospital. And I think it's really important that everybody knows how to do that. That, once again, is CPR. Knowing it can give someone you love the ability to stand here and thank a team that clearly says thank you back. I'm grateful to be here. And all I can say is thank you. At the University of Cincinnati Medical Center, Liz Bonus, Local 12 News. And if you'd like to learn CPR at no charge from the American Heart Association, we have a link on our website with that information. Just click on the Get It button. From